A car hits two boys in a crosswalk. Police say the boys were walking to a middle school when they were hit early this morning. It happened at the corner of Vista Avenue and Targhee. One boy has a concussion, the other broken ribs. Boise police tell us the woman behind the wheel didn't see those boys because of the frost on her windshield. Now she was cited for failure to yield. Morgan Wagner explains why she's got our top story. It's a problem that a Boise police officer tells me could have been fixed with one of these in less than 10 minutes and that it could have saved two students from a trip to the hospital. How much time did you give yourself to defrost your windows this morning and what exactly did you do to defrost them? Um, gave myself about five minutes, came out, turned on my defrosters on my windshield and my husband scraped my windshield for me. Didn't give myself too much time because <laughs> I wasn't expecting it, um, but I just turned the, the car on, heated it up and then scraped it down and had to get going. Driving around with ice on your windows is not only dangerous, but illegal. And a Boise police officer tells me it can be a ticketable offense. But he says it's a citation that he rarely sees issued. It's a vision obstruction, but it's ice covered window, uh, Idaho code 49612. It's a $67 fine. Um, we don't cite for that very often. Um, the whole purpose that we stop people when they do have windows that are covered is to, let, to educate them. The officer says the department wants to focus on educating drivers instead of bombarding them with tickets. He says the department does this because its main goal is to make sure everyone gets to their destination safely. Coming up, coming up at 530, it's not just your windshield that needs to be defrosted before you head out on the streets. What windows need to be clear? Live in Boise, Morgan Wagner, KBOI 2 News.